everyone Zave here and welcome to Tank Arena Ultimate League Overview. So many games recently have Ultimate in their title, but they're not necessarily that in their final form. <laughs> Isn't that term normally reserved in gaming for fully realized editions of projects after a while it's release? So it's kind of weird calling something like that from the get-go, but Maybe it is, who knows? <laughs> so Tank Arena Ultimate League is a tank shooter action game where there is literally not much to say besides you're gonna be thrown into 4 vs 4 matches and you will enjoy exciting times with different types of machinery all while having cockpit experience first hand. There was something similar that released to this called World War Tunes, if I believe. I don't necessarily remember how it performed, but it's not like a standout game on the platform. Tank Arena goes for more simplistic cockpit and stylized artwork in the futuristic setting. Also seems more straightforward and streamlined to control. Maybe specifically to me, it does seem kind of familiar to Dash Dash Hurt. The graphics and models seem polished, like there isn't anything to complain about. Only thing is that I only see players or bots, which would be nice to have, in one specific area and setting, nothing really besides that. Don't expect much depth with it, but could be cute to play for a couple minutes. Let's go enter the arena. Welcome, welcome. We have some controller descriptions and funky music what the hell <laughs> my hand stopped working immediately public lunges arenas yeah so let's catch the flag based gameplay and it does seem like only that. We have positions. I mean, I'm at DPS by nature. Why? Um, okay. That's sudden. I mean, is there like a proper tutorial though? I think I'm playing with bots. At least I hope so. Oh damn. <laughs> I mean the visuals are much worse compared to the trailer. What's happening? I don't know what's going on. I wouldn't say that the controls are the best. They do make sense, but it's kind of chaotic. Like, could I switch it to 
plant sticks maybe? I guess I need to leave to the main menu. Like there's not much visual guidance going on. The game is just throwing you to the tank and figure it out yourself. There is this which I just need to read it before the match starts like Hello? <laughs> this reminds me of all the US mechanics. Do I? Activating power slot. Yeah, but now nothing works. Ah, you still grab those, but you still with thumbsticks. That doesn't really make sense. I thought when I would let it go, then I could steer, but... I'm some kind of a sniper. A lot of cues. <laughs> oh, also, I forgot to mention it in the intro, but this is the same developer that did World War Tunes. So no wonder the base setup is very similar. I do find it much easier to control. Just like a kissing machine. Under fire. <laughs> Spitfire rolling out. Oh wow, even the cockpit is pretty blurry. Like the trailer was very misleading. Under fire. Under fire. Also, it seems huge. Under fire. Raven rolling out. It's a fast boy. Under fire. Under fire. Ah, uh, here I have. Under fire. <laughs> Raven, rolling out. How do you are very mild? Eh? 
Smash. What more there is? We can customize stuff. Sea tanks, shop. I mean, I'm not necessarily surprised, nor... This is just okay. <laughs> I'll try to play one more with more supportive role, but... That's pretty much the gameplay, like, not much will be changing. So we'll be healing and... Having some rocket situation. And this is a different map. Thank god something's different. So how does this work? I mean the textures are very bland. How do I shoot this? Oh, they are homing. Under fire. Warning, low health. Yeah, I don't have that much output. Echo, rolling out. I just need to follow someone. This is an important reload. Repairing ally with repair pack nanobots. Repairing ally with repair pack nanobots. Repairing ally with repair pack nanobots. The one damage. <laughs> Under fire. Pew 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 pew. Warning, low health. Repairing ally with repair pack nanobots. I behave like a TPS, naturally. Meted. Repairing ally with weight under fire. Under fire. Warning. No help. <laughs> okay, that's enough. So I would say that in terms of the visuals, the trailer was very misleading. The resolution I think is okay, it's just the textures are very bland. No shadows no shine it's just there <laughs> and the arenas don't necessarily have any dimension so it's just not impressive at all in comparison to the devs previous project this seems an easier time in general and more pleasant to play it is on a simpler side of things intended or not like it gets the job done putting you in the tank cockpit and causing mayhem. Controls might be a bit chaotic depending on which setting you'll go with, but after a while you'll kinda get used to it and turn around the corners. I would also appreciate to have more intricate tutorial. You can kinda read and understand what's going on, but then 
When you're in the gameplay, that's when the real practice comes around. In total, it's just decent, nothing groundbreaking and cute to play, but it didn't change my life.